Ron Gilberti from Monster BJJ versus Steve Tonga from Lionheart BJJ. Both competitors have taken to the mat. Ron has competed here at Rise before. So it's not his first time on the stage. But of course, when you get to this level of competition, Nick, everybody has plenty of competition experience. That's right. You know, you're not going to get on the rise stage, you know, with no fights, no experience. And uh, all these guys have proven themselves and uh, they, they're trying to prove themselves once more tonight. Really bringing the best grapplers from the regional and around the country, the national scene here to rise tonight. The level is always, it's always progressing. It's always going up, up, up. And, uh, I'm excited for the next one. I'm excited for this one, but I'm excited to see the next one. This card is so stacked. Ladies and gentlemen, this match has a 200 pound weight limit. Six minutes of grappling, submission, or a draw. Introducing first to my right, out of Monster BJJ. Welcome, please, Ron Gilberti. Little mix up with the corners right. there, no problem. Here we go. Ron so Gilberti. There he is. And across the mat out of Lionheart BJJ, here is Steve Tonger. Steve Tonger from Lionheart BJJ. Okay. Dave Pat, referee. And here they go. Steve's stance tells me that he's more interested in the wrestling yeah. out of these two. Yeah, and Ron content with sitting to his butt there. Yeah. Wants to play his game. Seems to be off his back. Looking for that triangle off the jump. Yeah, he might he have it. He's, he's, he's got out. long legs. He can hook underneath that leg. Yeah, Steve's doing a good job pushing that leg off the head. And as Ron was trying to get up, Steve shoved him back down. Now they're at the edge of the mat. They're going to restart. Right in that position. And that's why I gave him that stuff at the end. You know, the experience you're talking about before, you know, these guys, they know. They know, you go off the mat, you get that top position, they're gonna reset you there. Yep. Butterfly hooks for a sweep, possibly. Uh, dive back, back for leg lock, yep. Steve is looking to lock up that leg. Ron is standing up straight now. That's, a, that's, that's, that's looking pretty tight there. Is that the verbal tap? tap? Verbal tap. Verbal right tap. There. So he pulls it off. Steve Tonga with the heel hook submission. That's how quick it happens. He locked right up there. the leg. Ron Gilberti stood up. And that allows Steve Tonga to lock up that heel hook, roll through with it, and he got a quick tap. Once it's on, Nick, it's on. Yeah, those heel hooks, you don't want to play with those. You roll the wrong way, you wait a second too long. You're going to All right, ladies up. and gentlemen, that bout was stopped as a result of a submission by way of a heel hook with four minutes and 50 sec 56 seconds left. And the winner came out of the Lionheart BJJ, Steve Tonger, Steve Tonger, our match winner. Steve Tonger pulls off the heel hook. Here's the replay, gets that Ashigarani position. Clears the arms and there's that grip immediately on there. The knee is locked in there and the tap. Rolls him right through. 